Captain's Log. I've arrived in the region known as Kingdom's End, the most remote western outpost of, well, the kingdom. I, Captain Ernest Shack, have been tasked with leading an expedition to the northern regions of this new land in an effort to expand the reach of the crown. Representing the crown is a man known as Baron Von Slender. His task is to oversee the expansion of the kingdom's power in the region and to promote growth of the economy while keeping things mostly civil. Can you tell us, are the ports open? Is it true? Well, we have received this message from the king. From the crowned and direct, he says, Welcome adventurers to Kingdom's End. New lands await to the east and the crowned has welcomed you all to begin preparations for this grand journey within his lands. Prepare for hardship, storms and vicious seas, but also for the future. The Crown will expect all companies taking part in this adventure to set up recruitment offices within the town of King's Port, where we currently are. The Baron will lead planning for this and will be your point of contact for information. Our scryers report that the vicious storms and freakish winds currently sending any ship that sails east to Davy Jones's locker will lessen on Friday, so time is short. Until such time as the storms weaken, the Crown has closed all shipping to the east as a precaution. Till this time, keep the peace, stock the stores, and obey the Crown. All right, get out of my way, everybody, go, 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 go. Oh. <laughs> the first mini game. A sensible yeah, people are the one that doesn't have a timing. <laughs> Rumor has it he was some big wig fleet admiral and was sent here as more of a punishment. Now he's mostly interested in making gold and building up his personal influence over the, well, over the crowds. Oh, this is what's going on. All right. This is the Baron's Manor, I think this huh? Will be not bad for a summer location, a summer house, I feel. Fresh water ahead, boys. Onions grow in the lower lakes. And we have a friendly local crop of chicken. Ha <laughs> ha. Very nice. I see you've got some people helping you out here. You got some. Guy's getting work done. Oh, fresh water. This is our locale. We have a respawn bed and you said you're private going down containers to location down by the house there. And then we're building up a, a base that will overlook the lake back here. Oh, and this is that cliffside that we were looking upwards. I figure it would be a good defensive position if we were to overlap this edge with with cannons if nothing else it's a very good lookout point oh yeah that's nice boy the crown wasn't kidding about those storms were they Cap? no they weren't look at that wouldn't want to sail into that we should be all right heading south though for decades, the endless storm has blocked passage across the great ocean. Charts from the few recorded times that the storms have cleared show small bits of land known as the Westlands, and even more beyond that. My job was to recruit a crew willing to sail off into the unknown and head north, chart the waters, and establish a base of operations and report back to the Baron. But to do that, we need a ship and supplies, and a crew, a willing crew. That's just what we did. Over the next five days, before the kingdom's seers say the ancient storms would fade and the pass would open, myself and my first mate, Mr. Craghammer, began to recruit able bodies for the journey. From our base camp in what we're now calling the Old World, on the island of the Northern Reach, we established a small base of operations and began to lay the keel for our first exploration ship, the Endurance. A brigantine set up with two large speed sails and one maneuvering sail. Fourteen cannons and a stocked armory full and a galley with provisions and of course warm clothing for the crew. We even stocked up multiple chickens and a cow for fresh milk. During the construction, we used small sloops to ferry supplies between the different companies and islands, helping the Baron and the Crown where we could. We even managed to help the Baron find the proper deep water port down in the south. He's a strange one and has a thing for heights. I, I have a feeling there's gonna be a general announcement, sir. I'm thinking... Yeah, everyone should I know. I am, he's diving. Oh, there he is! <laughs> might be coming towards us. the bird. Is it a falling star? No, no, I believe it is Bat Baron. 
Away! Damn, look at him go. Where's he going? Oh, he's going all the way out to the lighthouse. There he goes! Oh, he's behind the rocks. <laughs> he's, there he is! There he is! Surveying his fleet before the great move west. Finally, the day came. The great move west. Just like the seers had foretold, the great storms calmed and the gates opened. Fleets of ships, hundreds, set off. Some lone colonists looking for a better life. Some armadas of larger companies looking for profit. Some looking for freedom from the law. The Endurance, under my command, joined up with the Baron's fleet for the first leg of the journey before breaking off towards the cold north. Passing unknown islands and braving heavy storms, the worst of which found us going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Ship of the Damned amidst a typhoon somewhere south of the Snake Nest Bay. I agree with you. Everybody aboard? Hi, Cap. All right, let's set sails. Full sail, let's get out of here. Some big sharks in the waters here, too. So if you I haven't apologize noticed yet, for it, Cap. Won't happen again. No, nah, you're fine. Happens to only the best of us. Hi. <laughs> so, you know, that, that's a thing. In all fairness, I was chasing some precious, precious loot. Sweet, sweet loot. Prepare for a port tack. Coming soon. Oh, shit. Sooner than we thought. Oh, God. Hold on the tack, though. We're gonna see if we can avoid these. Ah, in the back. That hit hard. Why did that hit so hard? Oh. This is fine. Thread the needle here. We're gonna go into the wind, and we're gonna go into this twister. We're gonna take a little bit of damage. Brace, brace, brace. Are shifting. Hang on. It's spinning us. All right, rotate those sails so we always are in the wind. Okay. Winds are swift and quick. Okay, all my central people that down below, you can run the sails from below. My camera seems to be oddly protected in this spot. Oh, we got hostiles on the starboard side. Yeah, I lost him in the storm. Oh, there they are. All crew, you have on the sail. Prepare, prepare on the starboard side. Prepare starboard side cannons. We're gonna get tossed, hold on. We're getting thrown hard. Starboard side cannons. Prepare to fire. Fire when you have a shot.
Nicely done. Keep firing. Trying to dodge, trying to dodge storms and cannon fire here. Good hits, good hits. Bring us in close. Hold your fire, reload all the cannons. Fire! Full broadside. Give them the hurt. Give them the good news. Good kills. All right, where's Tex Fire? Tex, where are you? I, I managed to somehow get back on the ship, and I managed to mana cannon. Excellent, well done. Another ship in the dam down to the port. We're gonna try to avoid that one. <laughs> set the sails, set the sails. Uh, we need repairs on these sails. A little bay right here. It looks like, judging by my chart, it looks like there might be a harbor on the northern side of Blizzard's Bluff. Let's pull in there. I see trees, that's a good sign. Cap, you're gonna have to uh, guide me in. I can't see anything right now. Hi. Neither can I. I'll go up to the command podium. Nice. Let me have a flare. We've got a flare. Go ahead and fire it. We got fog coming in. Anyone who got flares? That was bright. Eyes open for land. Eyes open for land. Uh, flare didn't help. The crew did well in their first engagement together. We even happened to lose our first mate overboard during the fight, but managed to recover him. The lucky bastard. Making our way north through a thick fog, we managed to make landfall on the island of Blizzard's Bluff, and began to make a go of surviving in what the crew call the Shivering Isles. I'll report more as time goes on. This is Captain Shack of the Endurance, and the Northern Expedition, signing out. <laughs>